One of the hardest things for us to deal with in life is grief. Today, as we continue in our 21 days of prayer, our theme for the day is to make room for grief, to allow God to heal the wounds and the hurts of our heart. You know, many times we try to fix it. We try to make it right. And the fact is that we come to a point in our lives we realize only Jesus can heal and bring hope to a hurting heart. In Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, Jesus said, Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Maybe you've had a time in your life that you could sleep 24 hours and yet you were still not rested because that's a, a hurt, a burden that you carry in your heart. And no amount of sleep can give you the rest that only God can give. Maybe today, friend, you're struggling with God doing something fresh and new in your life because you're holding on to a wound that God wants to heal. It may be the loss of a loved one. It may be the loss of a friendship. It may be uh, some bitterness or resentment that you've carried all the way from your childhood. I want you to know today, God wants to heal that. And He is able to heal it if we bring that to God. But friend, if you don't allow God to heal that wound in your heart, you're going to pass that hurt that you're dealing with on to others. I say it to our folks here at Havenwoods on a regular basis, hurt people hurt people. But friend, when we allow God to heal that wound Again, it may be a wound that nobody else even knows about, but God does. And when we allow God to heal that wound in our heart and life, the opposite can be true. Healed people can heal people. Today that you and I would understand just how much mercy we have received from God. God is, is a merciful God. In other words, He withholds what we deserve. And because we have received His great mercy, I believe God wants us to be a minister of mercy today. In a world that's so quick to, to judge and give opinions and ideas about everything under the sun, what if we today, as God's children, just decided God today... I'm going to be a minister of your mercy to those around me. I want to pray for us today. Oh God, I pray right now for each one who's watching this video. God, I really believe there's somebody today that's watching this video right now that is still carrying bitterness and resentment and unforgiveness in their heart. And as a result, they have a wound that they're carrying with them. But God, if we would bring our wounds and our hurts and our brokenness to you today, God, you can heal that wound. And God, instead of us being uh, one who passes on the hurt, that God, we can be a minister of your mercy and healing today. God, I pray over our hearts over our homes, and over our churches today, your healing. God, that you would bless us with your healing so we can bless others. We thank you, God, for your work of mercy in our hearts, in our homes, and in our churches. And God, today we ask you to help us be ministers of your mercy today. We love you, Jesus, and we pray all this in Christ's name. Amen. God bless you and have a great day.